The United States Postal Service is investing millions into our area as neighbors continue to see issues with their mail service in Tallahassee. I'm Kendall Brandt, your neighborhood reporter in Northeast Tallahassee. I'm looking into how USPS will use $5 million to invest in an area office and why one neighbor worries it's not enough. Neighbor Vicki Eddy has been relying on the United States Postal Service since she moved to Northeast Tallahassee. Way back in the 80s and moved in this neighborhood, you could actually leave, leave money in your mailbox and they would leave stamps for you. But she no longer trusts putting money in the mailbox after she dropped off a $7,000 check to the drop box at the Centerville Road Post Office. I checked and the payee had been washed out and um, a young man had put his name in there, signed the back, and ran it through his account. I met her at Pimlico Park to not only discuss her stolen mail, but also the $5 million investment USPS is making to improve mail sorting and delivery in Tallahassee. USPS announced last week they'll be working to modernize the sorting facility on South Adams Street. I've been following issues with missing mail for six months. A spokesperson told me in an email the investment will create, quote, streamlined package processing and distribution capabilities in the local market, and that, quote, delivery will be enhanced. It's news that Eddie says she was happy to hear. I'm glad they're doing that um, because our mail should be delivered, but now we need this handled. Leon County Commissioner Brian Welch agrees. That doesn't really address the alleged criminal activities that are going on with stolen checks. USPS did tell me in a statement, quote, this type of alleged behavior within the Postal Service is not tolerated. After working on this issue for a year, he says the new investment is progress. When you're dealing with the United States Postal Service, it's a big entity. I'm glad that we've been able to kick the shins uh, of the giant and make a little bit of noise here from the Leon County Commission's off, Commissioner's Office. And, um, you know, it's a step in the right direction. I asked Eddie what she hopes happens next. Do you hope that this issue gets resolved? If we don't investigate it, if we don't get cameras, if we don't try to resolve it, it then the people that are doing this are going to go, hmm, nobody cares. And if you have an issue that you just can't seem to get solved, I want to help. Contact me at the information on your screen so I can reach out to you. In Northeast Tallahassee, Kendall Brandt, ABC 27.